Hi Coordinates Collections fans, it's Lisa Cole again, and I'm bringing you the other January kit, which is called Champagne. It's so classy, it's masculine, but has really pretty feminine touches as well. It uses some really fun colors, um, such as gray, tangerine, orange, very soft, and some aqua blue. Um, gray is the color of the season this year, and we've brought it to you in a couple of kits this year, but this was just so beautiful we wanted to bring it to you and pair it with something so different like the confetti kit in the um, other offering for January. So our first inspiration for this kit was the My Mind's Eye Ooh La La kit for him, and this is a beautiful large paisley. I love the scale of this. It's very large. Um, again, you've got these really pretty color tones of um, soft tangerine, soft aqua, and this base, this gray background with kind of a creamy color. Very pretty. The back side is a really fun honeycomb print, also in that um, soft aqua and a little bit of gray tone. Beautiful. We're also bringing you from the same line, ooh la la for him. Um, this is kind of a, a, medall a very mi mini medallion type print, very nice and distressed. And the back side is a fun ledger paper. It's kind of cream. Um, I like it. You can use these on, in so many ways and it's just a very nice staple to have for your kit. We are pairing this with the Cosmo Cricut Ever After line. This is from a few, um, probably a few releases ago, but it went so beautifully with this that we just paired it up. And that's what we do here at Coordinates Collections. We pair lines that go beautifully together without bringing you just the same whole complete line. We are bringing and building from different manufacturers different lines to bring you a really unique kit so what we paired with the mind my mind's eye ooh la la is ever after from cosmo cricket and this is a beautiful soft gray with white um, flowers on it i'll come closer for this because it's very pretty and the back side is the soft tealy green with the white flowers again very pretty to be paired up with this and then also one of the um strips of pattern paper page from Cosmo Cricut. I love these. You know how I love all these border strips. You can do so much with them. I always cut mine apart or cut across right through the middle here and you get a really nice border underneath a photo that has all these different patterns but in a very small scaled way that just brings a little bit of oomph to your page. So I love these. I love how well they go with this paper and the back side is just yellow. It's a, some element sticker um, element strips as well but just yellow very pretty as well. And lastly, you're getting a piece of the um, Basic Gray Ambrosia line. This is called Chutney. Ooh, how yummy. Just, ooh, this sounds so good like on a piece of chicken right now. So this is so pretty. It's um, got this orange and gray. Again, it goes very nice with our, um, with the other papers in the kit. It gives you a little bit of difference. And the alphabet is from Basic Gray Ambrosia. It's this beautiful script. It's such a pretty font. And it's this pretty tangerine color that, again, we just coordinate so well. Love it. So pretty together. And you're also going to get the element sheet, basic element sheet from my mind's eye. This has um, all these punch out shapes. They are not self adhesive, but just a little dab will do you on these. You're going to punch them out. You've got some big strips here. Love this giant scallop and this bracket. Um, very fun. And you've got some punch outs, brackets, um, journaling spots, some little tickets. I um, really love this page a lot. There's a lot to offer here to, for many, many projects. Your cardstock this month is going to be a soft white. It's almost a grayish white and then a nice dark chocolate or charcoal gray, excuse me, um, to go with the kit and just uh, tone it down a little, a little bit again. I'm going to give you some base colors to build with. Your um, elements in this kit that we kept building from are some really fun Prima Sprites. I love these because they're polka dot, they're solids, there's different sizes, different colors. You can layer, put a little brad in the center of them, love them. And you're getting three glassine envelopes from Making Memories, which I think are so fun. Hello, you don't need to see my face that close. Um, I got three different little sizes. Um, these are great for if you want to tuck away a little lock of baby's first hair from a haircut. I did that um, for one of Emma's out, uh, layouts. Or tuck a really fun little message in there that's um, brightly colored, love that. You are getting this beautiful Say It With Crystals from Prima. Um, I can't find a color on this, but look at the flare on this for one thing, and I'm gonna call it pewter. It's not black and it's not silver, but it's that really pretty um, pewter type color of crystal. You just have to see this. Love that. Isn't that gonna be so beautiful on that page that you can create with maybe this um, paisley paper and oh, the flourish of these crystals, love that. 
You're getting some um, sheets from Jenny Boland's Memo Pads. You're getting this in a soft cream and gray. There are three little um, ledger sheets that you can journal with. I love these. Just tuck it in a little pocket. You can tuck it behind a picture. And you're also getting a little sheet of stickers. There's some stars and some journaling little um, spots or titles. And then there's two little um, punch outs that you're getting. I'm not sure who the manufacturer is on this. I didn't look that up, but these are fun. This is like a little sleeve that I can put around one of my envelopes. Fun. And one of the add-ons that I got this month was the Making Memories Glitter Bling Alphabet. I'm going to put this behind a piece of paper so that you can see it. I love this because it's, again, a smaller alphabet that's fun to use for accents. This is all silver glittery, and then each little letter with a little flare on it has a little bling of a rhinestone. Very cute, very fun for this page, very festive. So I hope you are going to be enjoying these kits as much as I am. We are all, the design team got these um, delivered yesterday and we're all working hard this weekend for you. We're gonna have a little delay of the reveal. It'll be on January 5th this year of, well, not this year, of 2010. See you next year. It's gonna be January 5th to give everyone a little extra time during the holidays with their family and give you a, um, just some really great projects that I'm sure you'll see some New Year's photos in these as well. So thanks for watching and we'll see you next year.